everyone and welcome back it's your girl marquita with marquita lv luxury i am going to jump straight into the outfit of the day the handbag of the day you guys should already have your wine tea and a snack so let's get started the handbag of the day goes to my beautiful dolphin hobo the pm size absolutely love this handbag i could have went with the marquita reverse hobo loop gm but i was like let me get this beauty out for some sunshine on today so this was the handbag of the day and i have already quickly switched but this is how it looks and i actually have it on the smallest so it can be the shortest i wanted to carry you know as a hobo and as a tote today but the top handle it is not detachable but you can adjust here okay if you want it to be longer to where you can wear it over the shoulder and it also comes with a longer strap as well okay so this was the handbag of the day i absolutely love this i purchased this i believe like at the beginning of this year or at the end of 2021 i don't remember but i am so thankful to have her in my collection I originally wanted the MM size, but my CA could not find it. So if you have the MM size, oh, you're lucky. But the PM size would do just fine. It does have a front pocket and I do have it back stuffed. It has a front pocket and inside it does have a side zipper with black textile material inside. Holds quite a bit. So this is the handbag. of the day okay and of course let's go over the outfit i believe i got this top from amazon i'm going to check my account if i if i purchase from amazon i will leave it in the description box if you guys are interested it is a crop top um uh, a crop top no sleeve blue jean top the under shirt i purchased this from walmart when they first released the fall items so i got this from walmart it was three dollars and my bottoms i know for sure are from fashion noble because of the tag inside and this is a size five and my shoes i already took those off because right now i just have on some flip-flops but the shoes of course my flat mules okay so simple guys simple look again if i find out where i purchase i'll check my account i will let you guys know okay so let's get into the handbags that i want to discuss yes i am going over two collections of trifectas from the graceful pm and also from the lv favorites I am going to start with the Graceful PM. I am going to let you guys know in advance, I do not have the MM size in the Graceful to compare. So we are only going over the Graceful PM size, okay? The first, I want to go over the monogram. I have worn this baby a lot of times. As you guys can see, the watermarks, <laughs> I have been caught in the rain. It is, um, the patina I see is coming and guys, I don't really worry about it because I love wearing my handbags and it is what it is. So no, I did not spray with Apple Guard. If I want, I can tie a bandeau around, but I have worn this beauty so many times and I absolutely love having it. I love the inside material. Of course, it is textile and it does come with a long side pocket that runs very, very deep. As you guys can see, the closure is magnetic, but to me, it doesn't work very well. So my bag is usually always open and I always try to carry it over the shoulder since I told you it's always open just for, um, just for my safety and just for security. I just feel a lot better when I carry it like this. You can also carry it like a hobo by the tote if you like. And, and I also told you guys, if you have a speedy bandolier that comes with a detachable and adjustable strap, 
you can convert this into a crossbody and i will show you guys a little bit later in the video so this is the first graceful pm guys look at the patina coming so many spots on this thing on the handle and the vachetta but hey that's how it is the wear and tear but i absolutely love having the money brown for some reason I just feel like it should have gold hardware feet at the bottom, the base of this bag, but it doesn't. Oh, well. So let's move on to the next, which is a handbag that I have not worn yet. <sighs> Me and Damien Azur just have this love-hate relationship, but I always love having it in my collection. I don't know, but here it is here, and it's just so beautiful. I haven't worn this, and as you guys can see, the magnetic closure to me is a lot better on this handbag, probably because I haven't used it, but it's still not strong, okay? You can see it here. Inside, the beautiful, beautiful Rose Ballerine Pink. I love this with the Damier Azure. Of course, gold hardware and a long side pocket that runs very deep. The price... $1,390, of course, of course, with the price increase over the past years, I'm pretty sure it's a lot more now. I purchased this in 2020. So here it is. Watch out for the color transfer, especially if you are wearing blue jeans or anything that has any type of color, the dye will quickly transfer over and you will never know until you get home. <laughs> So here it is, and I'm being careful. Or you can just spray with Apple Guard as a tote. And again, you can convert into a crossbody. I do have an entire video on my Instagram page. And look how clean and smooth this Vachetta is. This is how it's supposed to be because you don't use it. <laughs> this is it. Okay, so let's move on to my um to my favorite graceful PM. You guys know how I feel about this. Of course, I love this print. You guys know this. This is the beautiful Damier Bean. Love it because look at the beautiful cherry red interior up against this beautiful brown this is perfect carefree no vachetta you can wear this every day it holds everything that i need all of my essential needs plus my notebook and desk agenda it doesn't get any better than this so here is the top and guys look at that i have lotion on do you see that <laughs> if that was vachetta if this was a vachetta toe handle guys it will be staying that quick so here it is. And guys, you see the wrinkles? This is something that's going to happen with the graceful. It is going to happen to your top handle. I'm telling you now. It's a part of wear and tear. It's totally fine. You are going to live, okay? So just be prepared if you haven't purchased and you are looking to purchase. And over the shoulder, this is how it looks absolutely love 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 this print the inside of course magnetic closure hardly works i just think they should have had probably a zipper or a button because this is not it this isn't it but it's supposed to be basically a hobo bag so you can carry it as a tote in your forearm or again over the shoulder as you guys see peeking out, I already have the strap on. This is from my Dame B uh, Speedy 25 Bandolier. Let me adjust. Okay. Here it is. And so I can convert this into a crossbody. The handle, I actually put it behind. And here it is. I should have worn this handbag today. It just looks great with the outfit. <laughs> I should have worn this. But here it is, guys. And keep in mind, you know I always think about you tall divas. 
the bandolier strap adjusts so this can go longer but you know i like mine right here at my heel open closure easy access this is so bomb guys or if you have any handbag that comes with a strap you can honestly just use it convert it to a crossbody adjust you can have it over the shoulder so you basically have a crossbody handbag crossbody hobo handbag and i just basically just keep it on just in case i want to switch to a tote and i also love decorating this beauty as well is yes i love 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 adding this puff ball i purchased this from amazon i will have it in the description box as well but if you just want to add a little spice a little decor to the handbag it matches the interior and it's just perfect Okay, guys, and also, wait. Perfect. You know how we feel about the red. And this is scarlet red. You can honestly use this cosmetic pouch, guys, as a pochette. I don't, I'm not going to put makeup in this. I don't want to damage this. But you most definitely can. Just use it to hold lip gloss, hand sanitizer. This is perfect. I love it. I prefer red with Damier Bean over Rose Ballerine Pink. But Damier Azure, I want the Rose Ballerine Pink, okay, as the interior. So here it is. Okay, so guys, that was another trifecta. Let me know how many, even if it's the graceful MM, guys, even if it's the graceful, just a graceful handbag, period. If you have all three prints, in your collection let me know in the comments if you just have one of the prints let me know in the comments and let me know how is this handbag holding up for you and how long have you had it i've had all three now going on three years since we are entering 2023 and i can't be oh, i just can't be more happier i love them i love 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 a good hobo handbag but we need this in ump front leather. We need this. The graceful PM or MM. Well, I don't want the MM. We need it in ump front leather. That will be so bomb. Or just picture reverse monogram. LV, are you guys listening? Okay, guys. <laughs> Let's switch to our favorites. Okay, so we are going to speak on the LV favorite handbags. I have the MM size. It does come in a PM size as well, a smaller size. Before I go over these handbags, guys, I've had these handbags since 2019 and I have not worn them at all. I was going to sell them. When I say it's an attachment to these handbags, We'll talk about that later. But first, we are going to go over the beautiful, the beautiful Damier Azur print. This is the Louis Vuitton favorite discontinued bag. They did come out um, recently with a new version, but this is the first. This is the OG. This is the original version. As you guys can see, I still have the plastic the plastic is still here on the hardware, okay? It's been like this for three years. The gold has not tarnished. It is in perfect, perfect condition. It does have a strap that is detachable on one side. And there's only one side, guys. So you can just take this off and you can just carry it as a clutch if you like. And we will go over that. I will show you. It is a magnetic closure. Inside is the cream textile material. Take the strap out. It does come with a side. It does come with a side pocket that's basically for your cards. 
and beautiful guys this is beautiful and it has plenty of room here you can carry your um basic essentials you know your lip gloss hand sanitizer maybe fit a uh, mini pochette inside but this is a beautiful classy i'll see this going out for date night or well, not with this print i wouldn't carry it every day due to me loving jeans but it's such a beautiful handbag and let me see if it has a price Yes, guys, the favorite MM in Dam <laughs> Damier Azure, guys, $1,020. So, you know, you know, this is very, very old, okay? <laughs> this is old. It wouldn't even be this price. Even if they brought it back exactly like this, it'll probably go for like $2,000. So, this was roughly around, I would say, with tax, probably like $1,100. Here's the receipts. It was $1,083.75. Okay, so we know we're not going to see that price again. So let's get it closed and let's take this off and convert it into just a wristlet. Here it is as a wristlet. And this is one when you detach one side because the other side, as stated, is not detachable. Such a classy bag. Okay, but I love it when it is, the chain is draped in the front. Come on now. Okay, there it is. Draped in the front. You can have it as a clutch if you like. Keeping it away from my jeans. Just got to keep this gold strap in the front. So. And it does come with a strap that I honestly cannot stand. It has a, um, the claps on one side and on the other side it doesn't. You just have to uh, loop this through one of the D-rings and then you can actually clip this on to the other D-ring. And let me show you. I've always, uh, I just have a problem with this. I don't know. I just think this right here was just a poor decision. And so, guys, you just put it through. I can just see the wear and tear on this part. I can just see the wear and tear on it. And then you just loop it around. And there it is. Okay, but I also have a strap here, guys, that I took from one of my mini handbags. It is not adjustable, but it does have two claps at the end. So just in case I don't feel like going through all of this, I can easily just convert and just uh, use this strap here. But let me show you how it look as a crossbody. This bag is so beautiful. Here it is as a crossbody. and over the shoulder. This would be so cute with all white. Okay, so the first one is the beautiful Damier Azur. We are going to move on now to the monogram. Here is the beautiful monogram. I already have the strap on. And let me move the strap to the back because the gold is supposed to be at the front. The gold strap is supposed to, There it is. Okay. So, again, like I told you with the last bag... It does have um, a gold chain strap at the front, detachable on one side, and it's here. It's not detachable, so you can convert into a wristlet. Inside, um, smooth textile material, not like the microfiber material, but has a card holder. Slide on one side, and then you have one open compartment here that, like I said, hold quite a bit. 
same price. I purchased all three, honestly, around the same time. So here it is. And as you guys can see, I still have the plastic on the hardware. And it's still just the perfect bag. Never used. Oh, gosh. <laughs> so here is the beautiful monogram. And you can add the pochette batiste strap if you want. If you don't want to deal with any vachetta, this will be a 100% canvas handbag without any vachetta. So here it is as a crossbody. Looks so cute with my outfit. Over the shoulder. And if I want, I can take the strap off and use it as a clutch. Date night. Okay, this is the beautiful Louis Vuitton favorite monogram canvas, the MM size. And of course, you guys know if I have those two prints, you know I'm going to pop out with my favorite. You guys can see the red. Can you see the red peeking out? <laughs> the beautiful Damia Bean. Um, I have worn this a couple of times. I would say, no, I wore it once. I remember I wore it. Yeah, I wore it once. I had like a little shimmy skirt on. I showed you guys on Instagram, date night. That's it. Um, I actually had to find some plastic from one of my other handbags because I did take it off, but it's still in very good condition. I absolutely love having this in my collection. And I have no problem with the strap. It's not Bachetta. Um, You guys know how I feel about this. And as you guys can see, the wear and tear on it, and I've only used it once. So, but I can easily switch this strap out as well. Very, very beautiful uh, magnetic closure. Here this beauty is, guys. And let me show you because it just goes perfect with my outfit. And this is what I hate about the strap, guys. Look. Ugh. Okay, there it is. As a crossbody, this is so beautiful with my outfit today. I'm feeling this <laughs> over the shoulder on my grown woman stuff. I could just easily put on some heels with this and I could have been out the door. And if I choose to do, uh, choose to wear it as a clutch. So guys, let me know what you think. Do you have an LV favorite in your collection? Please, please, please. The original, this one, not the newly branded one that they just released, I believe last year. But no, this, the OG, the original LV favorite in your collection. And if you have all three prints, let me know if it's the PM size or the MM size. This is the MM size being the largest but the PM is just as cute. Guys, I am so happy. And just to think I was going to sell these. I was gonna post these on Instagram and sell them. Oh man, what I'm gonna do. <laughs> so guys, I just showed you two more sets of trifectas that I have in my collection. The LV Favorite and also the beautiful Graceful PM. So guys, that is a part of my collection. We still have several more days to go. I am slowly going through and I am enjoying sharing this with my YouTube family. So guys, let's chit chat in the comments. Let me know what you think. What do we have in common? Until tomorrow, guys, stay safe, stay blessed. I love you guys tremendously. Bye-bye.